Heart disease is a spectrum where you go from very minimal cholesterol deposition in the arteries to where you get a moderate obstruction which causes angina to where you get a complete heart attack. What you have initially is you have increased inflammation in the body that causes cholesterol to form within the arteries to the heart until it reaches a point where it's causing an obstruction in the blood flow. And that obstruction and reduced blood flow causes symptoms of angina, which is chest pain. Generally, angina, if it's stable, you will hear of patients and uncles and aunties who walk up a flight of stairs, they say, oh, you know, my chest is hurt, they stop and it goes away. That's considered as chronic stable angina, that somebody has this disease and they're getting medications, hopefully getting medications for it, they get symptoms and it goes away when they rest. There's also unstable angina in which you are just sitting, not doing anything, or with minimal exertion, you get a new onset of symptoms of chest pain, which means that there's a rapid progression of the blockage because there's a clot either already formed or it's forming. And what it means medically is that somebody has reduced blood flow to the heart because of a clot in one of the arteries that supply blood to the heart, causing chest pain and shortness of breath. And if it's not aborted with the correct therapy, then you can have serious consequences, permanent damage to the heart, and some, a lot of patients can actually die from it.